Hey, what's good, y'all? Sports Lab in the ATL, sports and fitness uh, here. Uh, like, comment, and subscribe. Uh, almost at 4K. Uh, this video right here is... Uh, I just want to tell everybody, for those who have followed me throughout the years, followed my channel, you know you know what I'm about, you know, etc. cetera. Uh, sports, mainly. Um, dibble dabble and this and that. But in this one, I want to actually... Just tell a lot of you, because y'all have been watching my sports uh, videos and my fitness videos, and everybody knows that I'm on a massive uh, fitness change, transformation, per se. Um, I just want to let I just want to show everybody some stuff that I take, and I want to let y'all know how I feel. I want to know. I want to let y'all know what it feels like to get big, what it feels like to put muscle, what it feels like to improve your body just what it feels like it, and I'm only going to speak for me uh I have never had muscles really I have never had the feeling of being strong I've always been skinny you know not fat but I've never been strong and as you can see the development is coming the feeling that I have is it's, it's hard to explain. Uh, those who work out consistently will probably understand what I'm trying to say. Um, I've been consistent since November 6th. I work out an average of six days a week. When I first started working out for the first couple months, I would probably do about two and a half, three hours at the gym. But once I was able to start getting at a good pace... You know, making you know, knowing the, the exercise that I do, the routines that I do, et cetera, and you know, and just what it is and it means to get back into heavy fitness, really for the first time. I've been able to shorten it out to about an hour and a half, hour and forty-five minutes, maybe two hours. Um, I love the gym. I love the feeling that it has. I love the growth. I mean, I. I mean, yeah. The arms are the first thing that actually really starts to show, you know, because you work that a lot. The arms, I mean, you can look here, you can see the formation right here, triceps, biceps. You can see how the cuts are, the muscles are. I've never really had that right there. Now, this right here is a lot of arm curls, a lot of tricep, bicep extensions. I do a different, I do quite a few different types of arm curls. I do the ones where I stand. I do the ones where I sit. I do these with the rope, with the, uh, you know, the, 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 the ropes that are attached to the little thingamajig, you know, and this is because of it. But it's not only just work, just the exercises. It's what you eat and what you take in. Um, I'm very pleased with that. I'm very pleased with the chest. You can see right here, those on Instagram see a little more in-depth, but I'm not going to take my shirt off. But you can see the indents in my chest. Now, I'm still working on this part. This is this takes a, a little bit of time. I believe these are my traps. So I do a lot of exercises like this to try to get this bulky. I do diamond push-ups like this. But I've never had this right here, right there. You squeeze, you know, you squeeze, you do that. I do flies. I do the ca uh, cables, is what I call them, the cable, the arm cables. I do that. I do the flies. I do the underneath where you go like this. So, I mean, it's really working for me. Um, I, I can sit, you can see here. You know, it's just right here. The feeling in my legs, my calves. I feel, it's like, like I said, I'm trying to under, I can't, I don't know if I'm really explaining it correctly, but it's almost like somebody just put extra weight on me, like extra skin. So I guess when you get the muscle and you get the extra weight, then you start to feel bigger. I walk with more bravado. Um, I'm still not where I want to be, but I'm very happy because progression, nothing happens just like that. You got to work at it. It's going to take time. But I fill up my clothes more. Like I said, I can see right here, and you can see the arms right there. 
Um, but I love it. I love what I'm doing and I would not change a thing. My eating has changed. I eat a lot of protein, like chicken, fish, salmon. Uh, I still like uh, rice and pasta. I do it in moderation. Uh, I don't want a six pack. I have like probably a three pack, four pack because I like to eat. But it's always going to be flat and you're going to see the cut in the V. You know, if you're on my Instagram, you, you'll see more pictures of those. Um, but I want to let y'all show you some of the stuff that I take. This right here is a new pre-workout that I got. It's called Ghost. Okay. I wanted to make sure it was something that's not like C4. Because I stopped drinking C4. When I tried this for the first time today, it was good. I didn't have that ringing sensation in your ear. You know, it because I... You know, I don't know about some of y'all, but I use my pre-workout also to wake up. You know, some people use coffee. Some people use, uh, you know, soda, Red Bull. I don't do the energy drinks things or I don't drink coffee, but I like pre-workout in the morning. So I, really, I take this twice a day. Pre-workout in the morning when I get up to wake up and before the gym. So I highly recommend this. It's actually pretty good. It was not bad at all. Um, I started with the low in, uh, loading stage of creatine. This is creatine monohydrate, 500. I've been taking it for about a month. Uh, I'm on one scoop a day. Uh, the strength that I have is more than I ever thought. I can lift heavier weights, and lifting the heavier weights almost seems easy. You know, it's crazy how that works. It's actually good. I've been doing the whey protein for about a week and a half, and then... Yesterday, I got this, the Bulk Pro Performance. It has 50 grams of protein, 1,340 calories, and 279 grams of carbs. Now, it says here, because this is for bulking, it says for a uh, high-calorie mass gainer supports muscle energy recovery and growth. Now, this right here, I kid you not, you can see right here, it's right here. The scoops on this bad boy, it says here that I need to take two servings a day. This is cookies and cream. No, this is not. When I say two servings, it's not two of these. One serving is six of these. So that means technically each day I need to take 12 scoops. I'm not doing it. Could you imagine taking 12 scoops of this in a day? So I've decided to just take six a day, three in the morning and then three after my workout. Okay, but this is massive, you know, but I found, I found myself, like I said, I find myself just feeling stronger than I ever have in my life. You know, I went to GNC yesterday and the person there said, he can, he can automatically tell. He's like, hey, I can tell you work out. Really? How so? And he told me, and then he said, he see the vascularity. He said, when you see the, the veins... Right here, that means you're working out. That means you're really dedicated. I, I hit the gym hard. I, I hit the gym hard. I don't play around when I'm at the gym. I got the earbuds in all the time. I make sure I have my stuff. This is for my knee. This is for my wrist. And I have my gloves. These actually help. Um, I think on my legs, the, the uh, uh, leg press, I'm at like 150 pounds. The highest of the bench that I've done so far is 175. Uh, the arm curls with the cables, I believe, are about like 60 pounds on each side. That's the highest that I've done. Uh, the lap pull downs with the back bar, I think the highest I've done is 180 on the fourth set. I do the, you know, the rows, the back row, seated rows. I do the one arm rows. I think I do like about up to about 100 pounds. And then if I do the, the together row like this, I think I'm at like 130. Because e each grip is different between you do the, the two hands and the one hands. Because the one hand is you're basically your muscle of one arm. You, you don't have any support. You're using one hand. Okay? When you got two, you got double the, double the pull, double the strength. So, you know, it's I kind of mix it up. I go, you know, back and forth. Um, I do a lot of ab exercises. So if you're interested in seeing some of my fitness stuff, uh, Instagram is staying fit in the ATL. 
And I'm not going to accept everybody on there. You know, I'm not going to have people just trolling, you know, but how can you troll this? Like I said, I know, I know I need to get bigger, but I'm in a lot better shape than I was. A lot more muscle and size than the times that you guys have known me. If I get like the before picture last year, so the before to now is a total 180. So, but I just wanted just to let y'all know the feeling that I have is something that's indescribable. You would actually have to be consistently working out to be able to understand the feeling that I feel every day. Um, my shoulders are broad, broader. I walk more. I don't. I, I can't explain it, but I walk more upwards like this. You know, I don't slouch. It's just I just feel different. So if anybody can understand what I'm talking about, just, you know, comment below. But I feel great. I'm looking great. I'm getting in, putting in the work, doing what I got to do. And trust me, guys, if I could do it, you could do it. It just takes time and effort. And you have to have patience. You can't expect to go in there and put on muscle or lose just like that. You know, I mean, I have to work. I'm still working on the, this right here. Okay, this... You know, it's taking its own sweet time, but I'm learning things and learning, you know, machines and weights and ways to eat and ways, you know, and supplements to take and stuff. So, yeah, I, I cannot complain. So if anybody has any questions, comment below. If you're heavy into fitness, hey, let me know what you do. Let me know what you're, let me know what you're trying to do. I'm going to do some more shorts. Uh, I did some shorts today with some arm curls. I value everybody's opinion. You know, everybody's entitled to their own opinion. Uh, but I did that. And I did a uh, tricep bicep extension. Uh, I'll do some more periodically. So, yeah, a lot far cry from when I dropped the weight on the floor at Bally Total Fitness many years ago. <laughs> you know, it's crazy, but it's all up here. Like, comment, subscribe, everybody. Sports Live Detail Sports and Fitness. Please like everything. And thank you for watching this fitness video. And I'll see you in the next one. Grrrr.